everybody. So I said that I would be back this week and I would share our big news. So I am here to do that now. But anyways, before I tell you, the reason why I haven't been vlogging is because I was afraid that somewhere in the vlog I would accidentally give away the secret before I was supposed to. But now it is safe to say. So our big news is that we are pregnant. So yeah, that's how exciting we are having a baby, which sounds really weird to say still, but anyways, so the story is that on October 17th, which was a Friday, I came home from work and I just was so moody, like everything was making me sad or upset, so I thought that maybe I was PMSing or something because it was close to time for me to start my period, so I just figured that's what it was because I didn't think that I was pregnant, pregnant this month. So I had taken a few tests previously that week and they were negative, so I just assumed that I was getting ready to start my period. Well, the next day on Saturday morning, I just had one pregnancy test left and it was just a cheap Dollar Tree test, so I was like, well, I might as well just take it since it's here. So I took it and I wasn't expecting to see a positive, so I just glanced at it for a second and I didn't see anything, so I just walked away. But I came back a few minutes later and I just saw like the slightest line like the most faintest line ever so I'm like well there's a line there but it's so light so I was almost like thinking that it was an evaporation line or something even though it did have a pink tinge to it so I went and asked Justin I said do you see this line and he saw it but he wasn't fully convinced because he's not familiar with pregnancy tests or anything so he was thinking that since the test line and the control line were two different shades that it wasn't positive so I told him that any line means you're pregnant, but we still both, neither of us were really that convinced. So I just ran out to the drugstore really quickly and bought an EPT digital. So the words would just pop up pregnant or not pregnant. So I just wanted like something plain as day to see if I was pregnant or not. So I came home and I took that test and within like 30 seconds it popped up pregnant. So we're both really, really excited. Um, since finding out I was pregnant, I have taken this many tests just because I can't believe it <laughs> so I've taken this many tests I've bought several more of them just because it's so hard for me to believe so yeah we are due according to um, my last menstrual period which was September 19th or something like that um, our estimated due date will be June 26th so that'll be nice because since I'm a teacher I'll be off for the summer and I'll get to spend time with the baby but anyway my first doctor appointment will be November 18th I will be um, eight weeks and four days I believe along about that time so we'll get to have an ultrasound and things like that so that'll be a lot of fun um, let's see I'm trying to think if there's anything else um, we were going to keep it a secret longer. We were going to wait until um, our appointment before we told anybody, but this is our first child and we were just so excited and we knew we wouldn't be able to keep it a secret that long. So we went ahead and told our family members in person and we told everybody else by we got four pumpkins and carved them and then we set them out at nighttime, lit up and it said we, it, no, it said we're having a baby and we stood behind it. So that's how we announced it on Facebook to everybody, but I don't know. I know a lot of people disagree with telling the news so early, and I know there are a lot of possible complications and things like that could, that could happen this early in the pregnancy, but, um, you know, if something, God forbid, did happen, this is still our child, and even if it's only five and a half weeks, you know, it's still our child, and we want people to know about them, and that's why we decided to just go ahead and tell people. Um, I'm going to start doing pregnancy vlogs and yeah lots of exciting stuff to come I guess so I just wanted to share the news oh and my mom got me this already she got me this what to expect pregnancy journal so I've been writing in it already this has been a lot of fun and this will be something really neat to look back on when the baby's older so anyways that's our big news I'm so excited that I finally got to share it with you guys and now I can start making vlogs again because it's safe to talk about it. So yeah, that's our news. We'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.